doctor by profession, but I, my love for football made me specialize in sports medicine. So I'm a sports physician, an exercise physician. We don't have a lot of them in Ghana. Very important, especially not only in first division team, it cuts across football generally. All right, can I have the next slide, please? Sports psychology, sports sociology, muscular fatigue and recovery. Uh, that's very, I mean, they're all important, but the later part is so, so key. Uh, I, I want us to start doing the right thing when it comes to players. Next slide, please. Bits of physical activity, exercise and sports for individuals and communities. So what we do is we make sure, uh, we, we, we try to create those preventive measures, how to prevent injuries. It's very possible and you can prevent injuries for players who have played uh, professionally. I mean, we have uh, Mr. Amza, we have Stephen Menu have issues with diet, issues with transportation. I'm going to shed more light on how we can prevent injuries. And even those injuries, football is a contact sport. You can't 100% prevent injuries. And when they happen, what's the right thing to do? How can, not every team can afford the service of a team doctor. And what can we do? What can we do as the management? What can we do as, as, as stakeholders? How, how can we manage injuries, give very good first aid before you can get to a tertiary uh, uh, institution, like a hospital. Next slide. Next slide, please. Okay. Well, people think about, I mean, this has nothing to do with psychiatric issues, or probably anchor four and the rest of them. Uh, sports, uh, sports psychology is, is, is that branch that seeks to understand the psychological and mental factors that affect performance in sports physical activity and exercise. And I mean, definitely all these things, you apply them to better yourself as a footballer or as a team. What are the factors that affect a player? Uh, 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 I mean, not to give 100%. What are the factors that affect a team not to play well? Individual issues, pay, cuts, all those things come under psychology. Uh, what we natively here call uh, I mean morale. I mean morale boils down to this. It's sports, it's psychology and how you apply that in sport. That's basically what the morale is. Next slide, please. Now, factors that affect performance. What are those things that will affect players' uh, peak performance? Now, like I said, I mean, for example, the first division team, uh, most of our first division teams here are ill, Vested. I mean, of course, facility-wise, uh, when it comes to, uh, I mean, technicalities, definitely those are the challenges we face. But do you know, depending on how sane psychologically a player is, like when Coach Didi was saying what he was saying, that's 100% true. We have lots of players in the first division. First division, well, when I go back from the UK, the first people I started treating with first division players, I noticed it's what we call fitness test for them. It's what we call VMAX, testing how fit they are, stamina wise, depending on how you're able to use oxygen. To be fair, I mean, this is probably a report I have to write, depending on probably sent to the GFA, for them to actually start um, taking the first division team seriously. 98% of the players from my little study, uh, when it comes to fitness, far, 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 I mean, well vested compared to this. Sorry to say, I mean, so-called premier teams. Mm -hmm. And the so-called invisible gap is so wide, way more premier, way more first division team. But for me, it's just, I mean, it's just the same. Most of the players, motor-wise, very fit, stamina-wise, a lot to write home about. Compared to lots of premier, I mean, of course, I'm a team doctor of Ash Gold. I'm not using Ash Gold as a key topic. I've been exposed to other teams. They come to me for treatment. And I noticed, I mean, first division players actually uh, the word to use stronger, technically better, and that's why lots of Premier teams just go, they just hop, take the players here, and we don't even give them time to play. With the play probably half a season, okay, he's traveling, and where is he going to? Probably he's going to Uganda to play football. I mean, that's by the way, but everything still boils down to, I mean, making sure psychologically we put our players mentally apart, apart. We all that, so I mean, what we're trying to do is bridge that gap. Yeah, we know you're playing for a premier team, 
but a first division is just like in, in the UK, Premiership and Championship. When you're watching, it's except you look at the edge, you know the teams who have played, you don't see the difference. And that's what this, what, that's what today is all about. And that's what, I mean, uh, I, I really wish more players came, came around and with more technical staff, but at the end of the day, the message will be sent back to them. All right. Uh, today it's been fantastic. We've had a lot uh, like this, but this is very uh, peculiar in the sense that the target group was the, as the first division uh, football team. I mean, they definitely have been deprived of a uh, lot of things and even knowledge. And I want to thank Betway for giving them this platform. It's a huge platform, extremely huge. Uh, I'm impressed by the turnout. I'm impressed by the exchange of knowledge. And I'm happy we've been able to use this to help, you know, propel Ghan Ghana Ghanaian football to the next level. And you can see everyone, it's really, uh, everyone um, is really happy. And you can see, um, I mean, people who are actually hungry for knowledge. And I'm happy uh, Betway has been able to give us this platform. And uh, I'm going to say big kudos to Betway. And I want to encourage them to do more. Thank you. Ready? So for us at Betway, um, we've always had various arms, and one of our arms has been the CSR arm. This year we rolled out the Betway app, which is for Uplift, and we have sought to empower various sports disciplines in various ways to allow them to contribute to sports in the country. And we have done it together with Galka. So we had an engagement with the Ghana Premier League clubs, we had an engagement with the Women's Premier League clubs, and now we're engaging Division I clubs as well. And today we've seen the resource persons take them through sports science, they've helped them on scouting, and the, um, the, the nuggets and information that they get from the professionals in the industry, we believe will ultimately contribute to the body of sports in Ghana. I'm saying, I feel you're starting on a better way to program in your DD. I dare you, she said, better way to play my NSA. Oh, my own young boy was sports, Muno. Yet the health science, scouting, the knowledge will be a bar, a besom, a bois, a ma, sports now, a moyano, a one more one more day on Monday and never cost you. And this, I wish I you DK and the Ghana Premier League clubs, now, yes, Samson, women's game, Ghana Premier League clubs, no so, aye, to see what division one clubs, no so. I had the professionals about when we did when we didn't come out and when we shot both players who buy our when we did the move one more I hope you come move and listen I'm going to mean to a call baby 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 I cost you share players I'm going to be able to some clubs no and see I don't remember to you who said so we bought clubs no more develop yeah I bet one my football no soccer any more Ghana you're from me a palu Abraham acting see one crazy warriors well, me very happy, and first of all, I remember Betu with Fabaso, and I was here program organizing the clubs now. Because we be a baby, I know. I need be also a couple of one team now, and in Quebec, there's a such program. No man also here. I had the anchor, Benjamin continuous like a baby, and I was here personalities about it. I'm a me me per se. In terms of we opinion, they did did it dramatically. On a scouting aspect, we are watching now. Many of them appear from and Dr. George did so by Oshie in players aspect. So we are needing more. How about me? I felt and also make us idea. I very good. And I must say, since I'm the kind of man who's so high, I had the answer. Yeah, because being an daily and also be yearly, and keep it me up by and see. Make us in honor. Yeah, by and yes, we are not a bad boy. Now my football, no, so no. I found out my pants off. I'm Obedamwa from Ofakatan of Football Club, the administrative manager of the club. Yeah. Well, I must say, um, it's, it's far, far from whatever I expected today. A lot of impacts, you know, taking it from the scouting aspects through um, the medical aspects. It's all been good. It's all been very, very informative. And I, I'm only employing all those in authority to let's try and as much as possible put together such seminars to help us through. Yeah. A lot, especially the health aspect, you know. Um, we, we are in an era where there is more often every now and then cases of cardiac arrest and all that. So to, to have a seminar like this which informs us and educates us on this, on this grounds, I think it's, it's been very good. It's been very good, yeah. Um, going back home, I am going to be the teacher myself of my team and you know, try to pass it on. Yeah.
ชิวชิวสนามเมกาเนี่ยเอ่อเซมินเอสบีซีเนี่ยบัวเอ็มอ่ะเอ่อดานิดานิเฉยเนี่ยมาบีอะไรนี่สูเอ่ออาดีบี